Good eve, ladies and gentlemen. Gazball's here with another poetry recital for you. This one is uh, for and about my good friend Mr. Ollie. And uh, it's effectively about... Uh, well, it's, it's just about him, basically. You'll, you'll understand. It's entitled An Interesting Specimen. So without further ado... Never before have I seen someone with dreadlocks drinking red wine. It's a rare sight, and one that I cherish. A memory that will never perish in my mind. I find myself laughing as you bang your head and grit your teeth to ruthless drum and bass. Your face frozen with the look of pure satisfaction and the odd pwaaah. All while holding a Bordeaux. You never slow your pace, and yet you never spill a drop. Refusing to stop, you jolt to the beat. The odd lunge forward and a stomp of the feet. It's entertaining. Almost as entertaining as when you manage to lose something five seconds after receiving it, as if your pockets are maze, or keeping it in your hand is hard. You bombard us with curious, nonsensical monologues and unnatural noises, impossible to recreate. I always anticipate your next flow of gibberish, your next golem impression or beatbox showcase, your face shaping into expressions never seen before, each day displaying more ways to make us say why, Ollie. But does this stifle your performance? Of course not. You continue on your quest to west out the rest, as you call us, each day becoming more curious. Your furious attempts to exempt normality is more than a formality, it's morality now. Like a tiger wearing a hat, you're dangerously daft. You craft thoughts out of thin air, which then come tumbling out of your mouth. Useless, meaningless, but beautiful in a way. In a way that only you can understand, so stand your ground. Look after these ridiculous thoughts that you've found. Keep safe, each and every one, because if you don't, then in an instant they're gone. Wandering away into the back of your mind, whether you find them again, is up to you. But either way, nobody can say that they aren't brilliant. When people stand around asking whether the glass is half full, you go and get water to fill it with, because who needs arguments? Debating what's right and wrong. Life's a song, and we all need to learn to sing along, so sing. Whether your lyrics make sense or not, sing. Sing about anything and everything. Because sometimes, gibberish is genius. You know this better than anyone. So share this genius before it's gone.